When we make a diagnosis of cancer, a lot of people think that it's just a simple diagnosis. However, a diagnosis of cancer includes many pieces of information that is very relevant, very important. Evidence has shown that up to 50% of information required to make clinical decisions is missed in pathology reports, resulting in delays in treatment. That's because there's been a lack of standardized cancer pathology data capture and reporting has often been in narrative form. That means that critical information is scattered throughout the reports with no consistent format. I'd end up having to call the pathologist and ask for one or several parts of the pathology report to be clarified or added or even reported in the first place. So it was very time consuming and disjointed. It was difficult. The pathology reports used to be more of a story. Uh, and we had to sort of read through pages and pages to pick up the necessary information. That's why New Brunswick and other provinces moved to electronic synoptic reporting as part of an initiative led by the Canadian Partnership Against Cancer. The tool allows pathologists to enter patient information in a standardized and comprehensive way. If we have all the relevant information in a pathology report, this will ensure that the patient will receive the ideal treatment for the exact type of cancer he has and for the exact stage of tumor that the patient has. The New Brunswick tool is the first of its kind to be produced in two languages. It's based on a best practice guideline developed by the College of American Pathologists called the CAP Checklist. Similar tools are also being developed and implemented for cancer surgeons. But with synoptic reporting, what's happening is that all the necessary information is available to us in a, in a standard format. And so we know we're not missing any information. All the salient features that are necessary to make a clinical treatment decision are now available. With it all right there in front of me, I don't have to uh, go back to the pathology uh, pathologist or even go into the uh, report itself. Patients get a faster, complete, comprehensive interpretation of the pathology report. It's gonna be much more efficient. A recent Ontario study showed strong clinician and pathologist satisfaction with standardized synoptic pathology reporting as a clinical decision support tool in the diagnosis, prognosis, and treatment of cancer patients. Beyond giving clinicians the tools they need for making informed decisions, the collection of population-based standardized information can guide local, provincial and national action to support policy changes that can lead to improvements in the effectiveness of cancer care. We are in the process of developing and implementing uh, screening programs for cervical cancer, colorectal cancer. So by having collaborative staging and synoptic reporting, as we introduce our various prevention and screening programs, we can assess the improvement over the course of the next year or two. So it's not anecdotal anymore. We have the hard evidence to show that patients are being picked up at a much earlier stage. And generally speaking, as you know, the earlier you pick up the cancer, the better the outcome. Using health information at all levels to improve patient outcomes and delivery of cancer care in Canada. One more reason, knowing is better than not knowing.